Alright guys and girls and whoever's there, it's A4 here, um, feel free to ask for the link in the chat and then I'll send you a message. Yeah, I'll send you a message with the link if you want it. This is Flat Earth Debate, but I'm not here to debate, so if it's me that you've come to talk to, I'm not here for a debate. I'm here for information. Uh, I don't mind sitting around on a Flat Earth show, considering that the Flat Earth is a, a topic that um, exposes NASA's fraudulent ways, which I'm very interested in. So uh, feel free to come on and share your opinions and you can debate on either side i guess you can bring some facts and proof video information it's more than welcome what i'm going to do now is i'm going to go back to my history in youtube and i'm going to screen share a video that i screen share last uh show what's it called Neil deGrasse Tyson exposed. So screen share, entire screen, I guess. Neil deGrasse Tyson exposed. Oh, wait, I'm going to have to check if this is going to like... I think I'm gonna have to mute myself during the 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 show or video, so then it doesn't echo. So I'm gonna play this one video, and then I'm gonna come back to chat. And if you want to um, be on the show, all right, here we go. Link for Tiffany. Um, how do I actually get to you, Tiffany? You don't actually have a send message. So how am I going to actually send you the link? Because it doesn't have send message via your profile. If I click on the little icon that says block user report channel art report channel icon and report user, but it doesn't have no send message. So I'm not too sure how I'm supposed to give it to you. Oh, yep, sweet. No worries. All right, well, I'm going to go back to this video and I'm just going to play this one video while I'm muted.
Were you taking up my screen then? I don't think I, we were actually watching it then. You dirty prick. All right, I'm going to have to play it from here anyway. We'll just keep on continuing. Watching these videos, I was dedicated. There's a science show by BBC called Horizon. I have hundreds of them.
been any time on Twitter in the past 48 hours, so you've heard about her. Our next story. Rapper B.O.B. blowing up Twitter with his theories on the actual shape of the earth. Rapper B.O.B., perhaps you know him for hits like Airplanes and Nothing on You. Did you just hear that? Tiffany. Yes. Did you hear the video that I'm playing? Um, well, I think it's, I have it muted, but I think that, um, it's not playing the sound anyways. Okay. I don't know if I'll make a video or not. I do have some things to say about Grand Falls. Anyway, here's Neil's part. <laughs> Look at this. This is in a cartoon, and this is the character that Neil deGrasse Tyson voices for. He's a voice actor, and he plays the this cat. This is the character he, he voices for, which uh, remarkable uh, resembles that uh, Stephen Hawking. If you sort of look at it, uh, something you know, a disabled person that's rigged up to a machine, and then somebody speaking for them. Yeah, I've seen that, and I I agree with you about uh, I agree with you and ODD TV on this one. Well, yeah, ODD ODD TV is simply saying that Neil deGrasse Tyson is a is an actor and a Hollywood actor, and he's no type of scientist, which I agree with. You know, that's the type of assumption that I'm under. Is none of these people are actually scientists; they're all clowns. They don't know if you know. They don't know if it's a ball. They're just speculating, and they're assuming that. Well, they're they're going out and they're pretending that they're so smart because they are the only ones that they feel should have the assumptions. <laughs> yes. Like that, yes, they they make a mockery of us by putting a person like Stephen Hawking. You know what I mean? This It's a mentally disabled person. They put him in a wheelchair, rigging him up to a computer so then they can speak for that person and then say that person's the smartest person in the world. That's, you know what I mean? And then that, that's a mockery of us and we fall for that. We say that that person is the smartest person in the world when we know, you know, we know that that can't be possible, that that person should be deteriorating. Yes, yes. I just seen... Um the the pieces put together for um, I know you've seen it the, the Hennessy commercial with the the gentleman that goes in the balloon and hits the water breaks the the dome you know which one I'm talking about uh, yeah I've seen a snippet for it yeah okay well they just put two and two together that that's actually a real person named um, Professor yeah Picard yeah that he really done that yeah I've seen I looked into that too yeah that he yeah really that was very interesting to me that um you know yeah, and then yeah. he said it was um that he would see the earth through a golden haze and it just reminds me of that song by the Beatles we all live in a yellow submarine <laughs> <laughs> so yeah it's when when you look when you look at oh sorry sorry <laughs> go ahead oh I was just gonna say when you start looking with your eyes open um, just all the stuff that you start to see and all the pieces that begin to uh, be put together and how anyone um, you, you're not under the un, uh, the understanding that the earth is flat yet you you, you just know NASA's lying I've looked into the flat earth for four years so I'd say that I don't need to worry about the flat earth when it's an active based reality. I'm under the assumption the theory that I like what would oh, what would I say? My true conspiracy or whatever I want to follow 
is my own and it's that Abel is a crisis actor and the Bible's that's why the Bible is written the way it is because like I try to explain to people uh, every book was written by a victor so then therefore the Bible was written by somebody the description in the books that the book gives uh, you get a description of a bull a bear and a snake well which one wrote the book the Bible I think the bull wrote the book because it says it's by the bull so I'm just going to assume that the bull wrote the book well how can the bull write the book when the book says that the bull was supposed to have died within the first chapter of the book maybe the books the lie and they're all actors and that's the script they follow so then they can do their acting yeah, you'll just they connect any them. fucking dots you can whether they're, they're it's like you're nothing but non sequiturs um, uh, your microphone's very bad. It sounds like there's water in your microphone. Yes, I agree. But yeah, that's I wouldn't I wouldn't like I don't worry about the flat Earth. I'm more worried about that. I'm I'm trying to figure out that type of it. I, I just yeah, I don't know how to explain it. I would say I'm a realist, and I'm still looking for information. Uh, I wouldn't assume that it's flat, round, a matrix, computer simulation. Uh, I couldn't assume. I, I don't know what it is, but I know for, that. For you, it's big. It's bigger. You're still trying to figure out for yourself um, who your creator is, and or 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 if you have a creator, or in that respect. Is that no, what I understand? Not, not more of a, not more of a, the creator aspect. More along the lines of. Um, before that, before that story, what's what I'm trying to look before the story. So before the Bible, if I can unbiasedly look for the information and find it myself, and the best place to look for it is with Bible preaching people, and this seems to bring out these type of people. So there's all different avenues I can use this for. NASA's corruption, you know what I mean? I can sit here and listen to people uh, debunk NASA all day, which then I find new information that verifies for myself that NASA is fraudulent or I can listen to religious point of views, uh, different angles and whatnot where it sort of uh, opens my eyes to different theories. Do you agree that the, the Bible is um, a flat earth book or you don't you don't agree that with that? Uh, no, I don't agree with that. I believe the, the Bible is a script for the circus. Oh, okay. I believe that if you just see a description of a dome, it's more of a description of a tent. Yeah. That's what I'd say. The description that you're like you're, that people are reading and they're and they're looking at it as a flat Earth representation is just a circus tent. That's the representation that I can see when you see that dome. I can see a circus tent. So unless we're living under a huge gigantic circus tent then no, I don't believe that we live under a dome. I just believe that the circus has a script and that script Well, the, the Bible does um, say that uh, we're in a, that he gives us a tent to dwell in. So you, we, you would be on, um, in agreement with that. <laughs> did, you, did you know that, that the Bible says that? That he gives us a tent to dwell in? Oh, I lost you. Oh, yeah, no, I'm sorry. I muted myself. Yeah. Uh, you some try to say when people say that it's in the representation of more of circus head and, and, and blending them in that God scenario. So uh, it's just a bit weird. That's why I don't really trust the Bible because it might, might have been before it was rewritten. So now that it's been rewritten, I can see it as a very chauvinistic and. I see. So you, uh, so do you know I'm the one that's um, going out on the road? So I'm the one selling my house to go and tell people to research whether or not the globe is true or not for themselves, you know, to not just um, assume that it's, that's the mistake I made. I just assumed that it was proven, it was fact, the pictures were real and the moon landing was real, 
and um, I just suggest that people question it and figure it out for themselves. And um, some people will still uh, feel that the picture is real and the moon landing is real, and that's fine. But um, traveling all and selling your house, that you're going to be able to accomplish what you really want. Have you well, thought um, about the I, end goal of what you want to achieve here? Because it would be you, you what you're trying to achieve is a mass awareness of the you you woke up to. So uh, I'm not too sure you're doing it the right way to go out and spread the word that way. Is you're only going to um, reach a certain amount of people within. You know well, what I mean, America just, or wherever you're living. You know what I mean, and uh, that's going to take a lot, a lot of got the technology right in front of you. You could use networks like these to uh, uh, appeal, like you are. You know what I mean. Yeah, You've sure. already reached out to so many people just by doing this, and I don't know. Maybe if you continually continue. Uh, if you continue to do this, maybe that would be a little bit more beneficial for yourself at the same time as other people because. Contact with you, it's a little bit easier. This, you yeah, know, if you're in one state, a lot of play, people they don't traveling around, and you know that that's a little bit of like there's a lot that could happen, happen to you on the road. Oh, I, 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 I agree. Uh, there's just some something burning inside me that I have to go. But you know, I just met a couple two days ago, and they didn't even know about the debate. They didn't even know that people, intelligent people, are debating whether or not the Earth is a globe or not. And so I just want to do it for the people that, you know, don't, don't have, that aren't on their computers, that aren't on their phones, you know, the people that have, just have no idea that the debate is on. That's all. Yeah, that's, I understand that too. I'm just trying to suggest you know what you've accomplished so far. I think I'm just insulted that you know I just learned that um, when we graduate that 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 cap that we wear is the mortar square. <laughs> really, like you you wanted it, even though they have their alternative meaning for it. It's whatever you wanted it to mean. Well, I just am insulted you know, by that. that. You know what I mean? Your finishing of your education was going to help you get through your life, and it did. You know what I mean? It got you to the point, and it helped you to wake up in in your own way. So you can't be at the same time. We do have to scrutinise. Yes, and I just I I feel I feel insulted that. Um, I was deceived in such a way that I didn't even question it, and and so there's just something inside me. I, I can't explain it, I guess. It's just uh, I wake up and I go to sleep thinking about telling as many people as I can just because someone told me. You know, I would have never known that I could question the globe if someone didn't tell me because I was just, you know, I was just dirt to dirt. <laughs> so I'm doing it for all the dirt the durs. <laughs> be very careful when you do it, you know. It might be a fun journey for you. You might learn a lot anyway getting that type of outdoor experience. Questioning it does make you a dirt to dir. What exactly are you going to do, Tiffany? Oh, I'm just going to I uh, I I'm I'm in the process of selling my house. Uh -huh. We're just waiting for the escrow to finish, but I'm going out on the road in a painted up camper yeah. um, with um, my personal face that Jesus that Jesus saves and my personal knowledge that the earth is flat. Wow. Joking, right? No, I'm not, not joking at just all. Just have it. Have it. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, this is, this is a big... Uh, She's trying to troll Adam is what it is. Yeah, because nobody, nobody would ever do that. Okay. Nobody's sane. So nobody with their right faculties, you know what I mean? Wouldn't, would ever do that. <laughs> well, for I never, number, had, I for never a number had of, children because I always wanted to travel. For a number and of reasons. And I have traveled, but without purpose, just um, just selfish purpose. And now I have a bigger purpose. No such, that, that, that doesn't make sense. <laughs> purpose that means nothing. 
You yeah, to, just for my you, own. You planned your trip. You planned your trip to go and live in the three weeks, and uh, and you find that as, as something negative. But no, I'm just saying that now I want to travel to um, share knowledge with people fun, and, but, and just let share, them know that share the globe is yeah. not proven. The globe is not proven. Why do you it's want a nonsense? theory. That is absolute nonsense. If Why it was if it was proven, we wouldn't be having this uh, this debate, and it and so many Why? people wouldn't be coming to the. Why power. do you want to share with other people? Because uh, it's so it's them? the proper thing to do. You know, if I had the cure for cancer and you had cancer, the proper thing to do um, would be to share that with that you. That is right, <clears throat> but to go and to go and Why teach a lie. Like Why is it? To do, it's Why would you want to do proper things? Does it take it? You know, there's just good people and bad people, I suppose. I don't know. Um, so you want to be a good person? So, Tiffany, you want to go out there. So you're saying the road. you want to be a good person? Are you both atheists? Yeah. Wait a second. I want to ask Tiffany. I want to ask Tiffany some questions. So you're doing it because you want to be a good person? Wait, so how about you? You just seem to want to take over the chat every time. I would like to talk to. I sat here and listened to you the whole fucking time. Now shut the fuck up. I listen to you talk to fucking. If I wanted to come in and take over the hangout, I'd have been done it. Again, this is what I'm here for. Just rule the show. Take it over. I'd have done it when I first walked in. You dumbass. I could fucking kick you any time I want. I could kick you out any fucking time I want. I could have all this fucking hangout. Let's talk to Tiffany. Jesus Christ, you fucking stupid piece of shit. Fucking hell, you're fucking dead. Go smoke some more meth, Adam. Go smoke some more meth. Go smoke some more meth, Adam. You got the memory of a fucking fish. This is why I'm going out, because if someone comes to this channel and tries to find out truth, they're not going to hear anything. I know, because he won't fucking shut up and let me ask him some questions. <laughs> me and Tiffany were fucking talking to each other. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Are you done? As soon as you talk, I'm going to talk from now on. Fuck that. You're not allowed to talk, man. Fuck that. Let these, let these two talk. Hey, that's not playing very nice in the sandbox. No, well, you, no, you were talking first to Tiffany, and I've heard this guy talk for four hours. I want to hear another conversation. I've heard you talk guy. for four hours. So oh, now you my shut God. The fuck blah, 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 blah. I was on here for 20 minutes. Shut and you the ended fuck the show, up. You're happy. Shut the fuck right, up. You and your mates ended the show because you hacked it again. All right? You and your friends because I turned you down. Oh, yeah. So I, I got hurt. fucking kicked yeah, out. You got so butt hurt that the show ended. It's a bit obvious that you were I got fucking kicked out, you retard. Blah, 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 blah. How did you even get Why the link again? Why would my own friends kick me out? How did you even get the link again? I didn't give you the link. Yeah, you did. No, I didn't. I can give you this link. Well, it was your fucking profile. I didn't give you this link. Okay. I'm, I don't want to argue about it. No, well, I didn't give you this link. I, I was watching the video considering you can go back and watch the start of the show and you can see the host say to me that they were going to invite Tiffany and then after they said that I went and put the video on that is Neil deGrasse Tyson exposed and from there you were already in the hangout so don't lie to me how did you get the link all right, are you're a you, fucking hacker. Are you trying to, right, are you trying to apply? The hack is, no, shut up. Are you the trying to apply that Tiffany up. gave it shut to up. me? Blah, 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 blah. Are you hey, hanging out Hey, don't get me involved because I didn't... I I don't know nobody. I don't well, get the exploit. Yeah, nobody. the exploit outbound. Nah, outbound. Nah, outbound's the hacker that should be booted off the show, and everybody should it's outcast it. him because the exploit. Yeah, if I'm the fucking hacker, you're not The exploit. Blah blah blah. If you really think I'm a fucking hacker, if you really think I'm a fucking hacker, then why do you keep tempting me? If you really think I'm a hacker, why do you keep tempting me? Blah, 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 blah. I don't give a fuck because the show will restart. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Everybody's going to know it was you. Yeah, that's right. Everybody's going to yeah, know it was you. Shut the fuck up. You're a dumbass. Oh, I don't like Outbound's ideas because he proves me wrong. Outbound makes me look stupid. Oh, please. Please don't let Outbound make me look stupid again. Can you tell me how that you're broke? Please don't. Please you both got. The, oh, here we go. I can. I can eject you. There we go. You can get ejected. Bam. Earth is flat. And if you mute me again, Sydney. There we go. If you mute me again, Sydney, you're going on too. 
So try it, Sydney. Try and mute me. Come on, be a... Gravity is imaginary. You do that again and I will eject you. Oh, he's gone already. Uh, he, he asked me to kick him. Gravity is imaginary. All right. So is God. What a, what a pair they make, eh? I have no faith in gravity. I have no faith in orbiting the sun. That's about as silly a statement as I've ever heard. Okay. So you were you're doing it because you want to be a good person? No, I'm doing it because it's just the right thing to do. If you okay. if you know that people uh, are being cheated on yeah. or lied to and you know the truth then the proper thing to do is to tell them. Okay, so why do you want to do proper things? I don't. I honestly don't know. It's something beyond me. It's a burning fire inside me that I wish would go away because, quite frankly, I mean, it would be easier to just stay at home and eat bonbons. Can I propose a theory um, well, as to why you want to do proper things? You could propose a theory like they propose a globe. Yeah. So uh, my theory is is that you experience what's known as empathy when you uh, you can relate to somebody else's pain. Like you say that they've been lied to you or you empathize with that pain. When you think about them feeling it, you, it reminds you of the feelings that you had that were bad and you want them to you want to remedy that so they can get rid of the hurt so they feel good so that that way you can you can feel like you made them feel good in ter which in turn makes you feel good it's it's all about empathy it's all about how our neurons will, will mirror the feelings that we see in others is is that would you agree with that i am empathetic yes i do feel other so, people so so it makes you feel good when you help when you do the proper thing Um, it's nice not to to um, uh, you know focus on myself so much and focus on other people. Yes. I mean, uh, and and it and you yourself feel good when you do that. Yes, to have true joy, you put Jesus first, others seconds, and yourself last. No, well, J O Y. Well, well, I'm not, I don't. I'm just. All I'm asking is that it, whether or not it makes you feel good. Yes, I have joy when I put Jesus first, others second, and myself last. It, when so is so spreading the flat Earth thing is that putting Jesus first? Is that is that part of all that? Oh, damn it! I didn't I didn't want to fucking kick her out. Well, I didn't want to fucking. Well, she, she she probably realized that she was talking the biggest load of childish nonsense that anyone's ever heard, so she was probably embarrassed and had to leave because of it. I would be. Did you hear what she said? I, what I was trying to get at was is that she said that she wasn't doing it for selfish purposes, and I've had this debate with people a lot. Like, you can't do anything that's not selfish. If, if, because if, even when if, you're helping somebody else, it makes you feel good. Yeah, she's so trying to made, achieve joy, right? You just said yeah. joy, which which is the selfish yeah. purpose, just as so much it's as... still selfish. Which is not a bad thing. The problem is is that people see that in a negative light. They no, there's a, virtue. there's a virtue in selfishness. Yeah. And it's not a it's not a bad thing necessarily. That's when to bring her her to that. Unfortunately I can't now because she got kicked. With Jesus with Jesus clouding her uh, mind, I, I don't think so. Yeah. Well, we were getting close though. Unfortunately. Yeah, yeah, no, that's fine. How, whose hangout is this? This is the flat earth debates hangout. Oh, uh, okay. Well, he's probably going to have to go start a new one now because it's just two fucking atheists that agree in the round earth. Well, you know, we could take this uh, we could take this um, opportunity to explain um well, well, let me take this opportunity to ask some questions. Um I was around and as a little boy watching 
uh, or listening to, on the radio to the moon landing. Because where I lived, there was no television yet. It was too primitive. And and then forever and forever and forever happened. And I never heard one word. I mean, you remember back in school, when I was a little kid, I learned that some guy proved the world was round by sailing all the way around it. You know, it was it was like when I was a little little kid in school, uh, this Portuguese or Spanish guy or whatever English guy sailed around the world and therefore proved the world is round. So I've had that as a as, you know, and then the globe, and then and then the 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 astronomy books and the science books and the I mean everything just sort of was just lovely. It just made sense, perfect sense, one hundred percent. There was the proof. People go to the moon. There's physics. There's astrophysics. Everything is right there. And then, th you know, all, a whole fucking century goes by. Some several centuries go by, and then we get to the year 2016, which happens to be around the time when the millennials or everybody who was born in the internet age um, are old enough to to have a thought and get on the internet. And what do they think? The fucking world is flat. It just it, it boggles my mind. T minus five minutes. Oh, oh, we we're taking off. <laughs> we're going to space, everybody. We're gonna prove whether. Oh, fasten your seatbelts. We're gonna we're gonna prove the shape of the Earth right now. Yeah, put in your G four socks. Or G force underwear, or whatever the fuck they give you. G force sucks. <laughs> <laughs> New hangout. Well, I mean, him screaming and shouting is not exactly uh, any. Uh, this, that's worse than than this that we had we having right now. Um, you run it for him. He's, he's kind of a child, so I don't see why you're running a hangout for a child. He's been cyberbullied be bullied because he deserves it. He has been cyberbullied. What the fuck was he doing? He is a cyberbully. Yeah. No. What the fuck was he doing? Uh, it, uh, it, trying not to let outbound speak like a little fucking baby. And people people you know like what? that deserve a taste of their own medicine. The la 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 thing. You do that when you four or five. When you're long, till I'm going well, if need. Somebody to lean on Cause they're stupid and everyone they know rejects their ideas And they have no real friends They need someone to lean on I have open debates, I keep, I keep my link uh, uh, public I did that yesterday, you can actually, I, I took it off, I, I wiped up the link But uh, it was public while I was live Oh, shit. And I do a show every. I'm supposed to do a show every week f through Secular TV. Where it's an open. It's a live link. Anybody can come in and join from anywhere in the world. So, and I've experienced no hacking attacks up to this point. Maybe it's people who hack you when you when when the nonsense that gets spewed just gets to a point where where people's brains start spilling out of the ears and then they lose all control of their uh, function the hand the ha uh, brain to hand functions on, uh, while the hand is holding the mouse conjecture oh you know what's going to happen this fucking room is going to go off air in about 6 minutes yep it's kind of boring without yeah. opposing views here, though. Anyway. Well, okay. Well, um, I think I think we should stay until it ends, though, because otherwise it goes into that that right. fucking perpetual glitch thing. Definitely. The flat Earth concept is the dumbest. Probably uh, an even. Well, it's the dumbest con. I'm gonna hope I don't get. Did you just kick? No, I didn't kick.
Sydney got fucking kicked.